Welcome back to my channel. Our very first SUV of the year is back, and the new Lexus RX is going big. Decades ago, Lexus cut through the traditional SUV marketing BS to deliver what many wanted at the time, and still do, SUV looks with the premium experience. It was a formula that changed the game and helped the RX become the best-selling luxury SUV in the US. The RX enters its latest generation with multiple powertrain options and a new look inside and out. The updated RX lineup smartly mixes traits we've come to expect from a Lexus with new ones you wouldn't normally think to ask about. Including the new for 2024 RX 450H Plus plug-in hybrid. The RX now has four powertrains to choose from. Below the RX 450H Plus tech flagship model is the standard, gas-powered RX 350, a similarly priced RX 350 hours hybrid, and an RX 500H hybrid model that trades some efficiency for power and a half serving of sportiness. A couple judges reported having some fun throwing the RX around in the corners though most models are tuned for cruising more than athleticism. The RX is better off for this focus. Compliments flowed in praising, most of, the RX's interior, from the high-quality materials to a dual-height cup holder. While you're futzing with the cup holders or admiring the way Lexus windows slow down right before they close, pay attention to potholes and uneven pavement. Some judges called out what they thought was subpar ride quality on the RX 350H, which was too harsh over larger road imperfections, with undue vibrations coming through the steering wheel and pedals. These levels of NVH might be acceptable in something like a RAV4, Associate Editor Alex Sleen said, but I want more isolation in this Lexus. That's too bad because we appreciate the off-the-charts value factor. A quick refresher, the RX 350H hybrid costs the same as a non-hybrid AWD model yet scoots to 60 miles per hour in about the same amount of time. No one else is doing this in the mid-size luxury SUV segment. What's especially impressive is that the RX goodness is delivered in a conveniently sized, Strictly two-row package with comfortable rear seats that offer a power recline feature all in the $50,000-$70,000 range. Larger midsizers like the BMW X5 and Mercedes-Benz GLE also offer upscale features, but they start in the $65,000 range. At that price, a loaded RX gets a modern infotainment system but the rest of the cabin still needs attention. Lexus really needs to let the team that did the infotainment screen do the instrument cluster, as well, features editor Scott Evans said. The mismatched graphics and colors are frustrating in a luxury vehicle. The instrument panel is also too small. But that criticism pales in the face of something Lexus continues to do right, year after year. No, not the US top safety pick plus, but long-term value. For the past five years, the RX nameplate has earned a good or excellent rating from Intel A Choice, which tracks how much cars will cost over the long term. Is that peace of mind worth a vibration here and a beeping driver distraction system there? With the new RX, we understand why so many buyers answer yes. Thanks for watching video.